Hey, welcome back to Drum Bits, everybody. So today, I'm going to show you a new hi-hat pattern. It's used a lot in blues, so it's a shuffle. And it's kind of swingy, but it's shuffly because that's what it's called. It's a shuffle. Use it in blues, okay? Um, you can play a bunch of different grooves with this, but basically what you're playing on the hi-hat, I'll show you and then I'll explain it to you. You're playing. Okay. There's all different types of shuffles. This is a very simple one. Uh, the hi-hat pattern is uh, one, a two, a three, a four, a one, a two, a three, a four, a. Okay. So you're kind of swinging. It's like swinging eighth notes almost. Okay. So you're playing eighth notes. One and two and three and four and. And you're moving the ands to, to the uh. That's the easiest way to think about it. So the uh in the measure, one E and uh, that's where the second note uh, gets pushed to. Just like the the uh, two, uh, three, uh, four, uh, instead of the ands. So instead of one and, you got one E and uh. So it's a little pushed, okay? One, a two, a three, a four, a one, a two, a three, a four, uh. All right? Now, straight groove. There's a couple ways to play it. You can play it with a halftime feel. You can play it with a regular time feel. I'll go over that in a different drum bits. But for now, practice swinging that hi hat. So straight, swung. When you swing those notes, I kind of do it with a push on the numbers. So I use the side of my hi hat for the push and the top for the uh. So the number would be the side and the top would be the uh. Be kind of doing this with my wrist up and down kind of a molar technique that which you can look up online but uh, that's the way I play it to give it a little push instead of just a one a two a three a four a one a two that's fine but I give it a push kind of like that all right so the difference in with the groove I'll show you the difference playing on top We're playing it on the side with the push. Okay? A little bit of difference there. It gives it a different feel. So practice it and come back for another drum bits and I'll show you something else to do with it. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like what you're seeing with these drum bits, you can go to my website, www.pwd.com, and see more in depth, longer lessons. Uh, it will be posting some of those and you can download them. So go check them out.